deep within the world that lies beneath our feet, where the sunlight scarcely dares to venture, mysterious creatures dwell silent predators with sharp jaws and calculated movements. They are the guardians of the underground realm, masters of ambush and stealth. Today, we will delve into this hidden underworld to witness the secrets of these invisible hunters. The abilities of these eerily ingenious creatures have taken on countless forms and behaviors, adapting to a world where every move can mean life or death. From the depths of a hole, an imposing, giant creature with eight eyes watches the outside with suspicion. It is the wolf spider, digging its den to protect its young from any threat. But this imposing creature is insignificant compared to a legion that shakes the ground with its march, the unstoppable ants. They hide in a complex labyrinth of tunnels, where no living creature would dare invade their world, emerging in unison from the shadows at the slightest threat. But none of these titans inspire as much respect as the one we'll see next. A nightmare with a hundred legs emerges from its lair to the surface, in search of its next prey. It is the centipede, a creature of unstoppable speed and venomous fangs, from which nothing and no one escapes. Even the most agile insects are in danger when they cross paths with this fearsome predator. They use their tail as a decoy, confusing both prey and predators so that they never know where their head is. Pay attention to the stunning scene we'll see next. The Scolopendra uses its tail to catch the fly, a behavior never before seen in this species. Although it seems to lack a great appetite, its predatory instinct remains constantly active. Every time the fly approaches, it reacts immediately, capturing it with surprising ease. Finally, it did it. It caught the prey with its relentless claws, delivering a venomous bite with surgical precision. Scolopendras, masters of adaptation, actually have a pair of modified legs called forcipules, which function as venomous fangs. There's no rush to start eating. It keeps the fly trapped, and even if it manages to escape, it won't get far, as it's under the paralyzing effects of a powerful neurotoxin. The behavior of these millipedes, still shrouded in mystery, reveals a fascinating duality. While they are extremely aggressive and territorial, even with their own kind, the female Scolopendra demonstrates impeccable motherhood, caring for and protecting her young until they're ready to become independent predators. Once it's finished eating, it retreats from the scene with determination. Nothing can stop this formidable creature capable of slipping through the smallest holes and sliding into the safety of its realm, the underground world. But pay attention, because the arachnid we'll see next could be one of the most spectacular underground creatures of all. It digs tunnels up to 30 centimeters deep, at the entrance of which it creates a camouflage trapdoor, equipped with a delicate silk hinge which it uses to open or close its lair at will. I present to you the fascinating trapdoor spider. In this case, a male specimen that, although usually a calm creature, transforms into a true unleashed fury the moment it feels threatened. I had to offer it a small mealworm as a gift to calm the fury of this colossal beast. But if this spider has inspired respect, get ready to witness the female of its species.
It is a living fossil, a trapdoor spider that has changed very little over millions of years. Its ancestral design, though simple, is incredibly effective, allowing it to survive in a constantly changing world thanks to its ingenious ambush strategy and its ability to adapt to the underground environment. Here is a demonstration of its colossal ability, an unleashed force that defies all expectations and makes it clear why it dominates its underground realm. When I tried to remove the stick, it was impossible. It was trapped with such force between its enormous chelicera that I couldn't move it. I had no choice but to wait for it to calm down and release it of its own will. Its venom, composed of powerful toxins designed to immobilize its prey quickly, is a lethal weapon it uses with precision. Its fangs, as large as a cat's claw, are the perfect tool to inject this venom with devastating force. That's how the stick ended up, marked with deep holes that reveal its devastating power. I decided to create an ecosystem for this spectacular spider using minimal decoration so as not to interfere with its development. I added clay soil to the terrarium, perfect for it to build its tunnels, allowing me to observe its fascinating behavior in full detail. I made two holes in the terrarium, leaving it the choice of which would be the most suitable to build its new lair. Eventually, it would select the one that offered the most comfort and security, filling it with silk to reinforce its walls. Over time, it would transform the entrance into a master trap, creating a perfect camouflage trapdoor from which it would surprise its prey and carry out its ambushes. Silk is crucial in the construction of its fortress, as it ensures the structure withstands the passage of time, rain, and the harshness of the weather. Additionally, it acts as an alert system, allowing it to detect any intruder daring to cross its threshold. I did the same with the male and tried to feed him again, and he accepted. These spiders have the surprising ability to go months without eating while tirelessly wandering in search of females. Trapdoor spiders remind us that even in the depths of the earth, where the world seems still and silent, there is life full of ingenuity and resilience. And although their appearance may inspire fear, they are guardians of an underground ecosystem that remains, in many ways, a mystery to us.